Hey, what's going on guys? Welcome back to Funko Pop Central. Today, you guys have asked for it so much, so we are doing an online Funko Pop hunting video. This is going to be episode number four, so let's get right into it. So guys, last episode, if you watched the last one, if not, you guys can go watch it right now, but um, we lost pretty big. We lost two auctions, we lost a crusty one and another one, and today I am not going home. Well, I guess I'm already home, but I'm not leaving this video without buying something, um, winning some auction, or even if it's a buy it now, I don't care. But guys, we are definitely going to win something today. Alright guys, so this is the first one we have pulled up here, and you guys know I love Spongebob. This is a Spongebob Squarepants uh, Glow in the Dark Hot Topic exclusive. So this one is super cool. Um, it's not an auction, it's, it's more of just like a buy it now type of thing. Um, so if I wanted to, I could spend $86 right now and get it, and it would ship here in a couple of days. But it's really not worth $86, so I'm going to make this guy an offer of about $60, maybe we'll do $65, try and get $10 off of it. Because that $11 shipping really kind of kills this deal, just because I think the pop is worth around $60 to $65, which I don't mind paying a little over because I really need to complete my Spongebob set. I only need three more pops from the set. I need the uh, glow-in-the-dark one, I need the golden one, and then I need a metallic Spongebob. So those are the only ones I need, so I really do need this one. So I'm going to make this guy an offer of 65 and if he doesn't accept it, then it's whatever. I, I, I'm not too worried about it because still I'm paying $76 for this guy, and I think he's worth 50 So um, we're going to make this guy an offer of 65 here. Review offer, submit offer. Um, okay, so yeah, it just says, like, please allow two days to... Oh, it's Mr. Joshua, dude. Okay, this has got to work out because my name is Josh, too. Anyways, guys, so... Um, if this guy responds quickly, I'll let you guys know. But yeah, I'm just going to pretty much update you when this guy responds. But we are going to continue on with the hunt. Alright guys, so I just spent the last half hour looking through eBay. And I could not find any auctions ending within like the next day that I actually wanted to bid on. So, kind of bad on my part because I should have planned it out a little better. But I do want to get this video uploaded today for you guys because so many of you have been asking for it. So, we are just going to switch it up a little bit. And we are actually on Facebook in a group called Funko Pop buy sell trade has over 70,000 members super awesome group I bought a lot of grails from this site um, I probably bought more grails from this site than I have from eBay um, just because it's a little more credible and uh, I don't know I kind of just like how it works a little bit better so I have one two three four five six tabs pulled up of pops that I want to buy and I'll make offers on so what I'll do is probably just show you the pops show you the one I want to bid on and then show you me messaging um, the seller and then kind of like the uh, little debate that we'll have about price and everything like that so um i don't know how this is gonna work let me know if you guys like it when we kind of switch up the website a little bit but anyways let's get right into it all right guys so this first one is a lot of cool um ad icons and disney pops you got george sanderson you got sully the new flock sully from toys r us peter pan the flock tricks rabbit toucan sam and these are really cool so i i honestly just noticed that it says for trade only uh, I guess we can look what he, see what he's looking for. So Red Eyed Freeze, um, um, All Might Glow. I don't even know what that is. Um, SpongeBob. We do have SpongeBob, but I'm not gonna trade my SpongeBob. So I guess we'll just get off of this one because I'm probably not gonna trade um, for pops. I don't know. Uh, it, it'd be kind of hard. I really don't want to trade my SpongeBob for for any of these. Um, so yeah, we'll go to the next one here. This one is for sale and for trade. I guess I should have looked at that before. But um, so. These ones are kind of like from older movies. Um, you got The Hobbit, you got uh, Pulp Fiction, Goonies, um, another Hobbit one, and Star Wars. So these ones are really cool. I really want that Queen uh, Amidala and also the Vincent Vega. Um, I really like Pulp Fiction. I don't know why. I know it's a little before my time, but um, I'm gonna see how much he's selling that one for. Let's see. So Amidala is two hundred. So that's a little much. And Vincent Vega is a hundred and fifty with an asterisk. Um, boxes are in good, okay, so the Vincent Vega isn't even in good condition, so I guess we will move right on to the next tab here. So this one, I just kind of put in there for fun, because I probably won't be able to buy these ones. Um, but this is a really cool one. I, I was so close to buying this, uh, holographic Darth Vader a couple of months ago, but I just never pulled the trigger, and I wish I did, but, um, so it's for four sixty five. I don't know, guys, we might, ah, uh, no, I don't think we can, but... That's a really cool one. I'll definitely want to buy that one in the near future. But we'll move on to the next tab here. So this is like a a, a full Conan um, one. So 
Price doesn't include uh, shipping. I don't sell individually. Payment by... Okay, so where does it show the price, though? I don't see the price. Oh, so it's like... Okay, so I guess you can only buy all of them. That's kind of dumb. Is there an individual? Let's see if there's an individual pricing. So... Okay, I guess there's not an individual price. You have to buy them all, and I'm not gonna spend two grand on a couple of Conan pops. So, okay, guys, this this is this might be uh this might be bad here, but this one's really cool. Okay, so you got Alien, Mike Wazowski, Sully, and Boo. So these are awesome Disney grills, and we'll see how much he's selling them for. So Alien is two sixty, Boo is two fifty, Sully is one ninety, and Mike is one ninety. So all boxes are about an eight point five to nine, except for Boo. She's maybe a solid seven. Okay, so, guys, these are really cool ones. Uh, I really would be happy with getting any of them. Um, so, Alien is how much? 260 Alright, so you guys know I just sold Syndrome for 250 So, if I could get him down to 250 on Alien, I might want to do that. Um, all shipped in hard stacks with insurance. We'll accept PayPal. Good. Okay, so that's good, because um, that money is on PayPal. Um, so guys, I don't know if I should do the alien or the mic. I should do these live, just because I don't really know. Um, I wish I had some input from you guys, but I think we're going to go with the alien. Um, just because I do want to start completing some of the Toy Story pops. So we are going to message this guy and ask him um, uh, if alien is still available. Is alien still still available and it, okay one thing you guys might know about me if you guys see me start typing a lot is i suck at spelling but um i'll just put that out there in case i spell anything wrong so i don't get roasted in the comments but we will send that and then like i said just with the spongebob by the way the spongebob uh no news on the spongebob yet but we are going to i guess leave that open and then just look at this next one here um, so these, um, okay, so the Incredibles, uh, are only in the set, actually, I'm gonna move this over a little bit here, um, okay, I'll just close it, um, but yeah, I'll update you guys if the, either the Spongebob or that one ha has any news, but, so this one, another bunch of Disney Grails, so I guess the Incredibles, uh, you can only buy as a set for, um, 650, okay, that's not that bad, so 650 for that set. Um, which I just sold, I already have a Syndrome, and I just sold a Syndrome, so I probably won't, it wouldn't make sense for me to buy that set, but the Mare is 580, which is a ton, and then the Monsters, Inc. set is 650, so I guess he's only selling in sets, um, which is, I don't know, I don't really like when people do that, but I don't know, I guess it makes sense, because they want to get rid of them all at one time, but guys, we did kind of put an offer in, uh, for this alien right here, so that's gonna be a super cool one I really hope that that one comes through and I'm gonna update you guys uh, when this guy responds All right guys, so we got a response from the other one. and It says hello. Yes, ma'am. He is still available um, And it says ma'am because I'm on my mom's Facebook account because like they don't accept you if you don't have like a legit Facebook account and I really don't I just made it to try and join the group so I got rejected from the group um, But my mom's account got accepted because she has like a legit, you know, she looks like a legit person so I found my mom's Facebook account. That's why it says ma'am. But it's still available. So I guess I'm going to just say, let me get it. Um, I, Yeah, I guess I'll just uh, say, um, okay, I'll take it. Is there shipping on it? Actually, here, let me go back to that post and see if there's shipping on it or not. Because for 265 I can definitely afford that. Um... Oh, for 260 Okay, so that's not bad at all. Um, let me also check... Um, let me also check a Stashpedia really quick while we're on here. Just to make sure that we're not getting completely ripped off. Like, I don't mind paying a little extra just because pops do tend to go up in value. Like, especially with Toy Story 4 coming out. Uh, so let's go Alien and see. So he is at 237 so that is quite a bit more, but to find a mint alien is kind of tough too. Um, huh? How much more is that? That's like that's like twenty five dollars more, twenty three dollars. I don't know, guys. Um, that is quite a bit more, but it, it it's getting super hard to find a mint alien box. Um, 
uh, I don't know, guys. I really want one, but I'm not sure if it's worth $23. I mean, for a mint box, I guess it is worth it, because if you guys do look at Stashpedia, you have to remember that some of those people that are selling those pops, they're selling super damaged ones, which brings down the price a little bit. So you do have to um, take that into account when buying pops uh, that are that expensive. So I think, you know what, I'm just going to say, okay, I'll take it. Um, so guys, we got Alien... Uh, I guess I'll show you the PayPal receipt so you know that I'm not lying or whatever. But, um, yeah, so we will get that all squared away on PayPal. And then we will come back and see if we can find any more auctions on eBay. Alright guys, so that's pretty much going to do it for the video. I'm going to pay that lady on uh, PayPal, but I'm not really going to show that because I think, I don't know, I don't want anything to get shown or like my pay I don't know. Uh, I just don't really feel comfortable showing like all that PayPal information on there. But you guys will see an unboxing on the Alien pretty quick here. And then maybe on the SpongeBob. Um, I, I haven't gotten a response back from the guy. Um, if I get a response by the time I edit and upload this video, then I'll just throw it in the end. But um, it's looking like I'm not going to get a response from him very quickly. So if I do an unboxing video when I do the Alien one, then you guys will know that I got it. I guess we'll just do it that way. But I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. Be on the lookout for the Alien unboxing. I'm super excited to get that one in the mail. Anyways, guys, I hope you enjoyed it. Leave a like if you did. Subscribe if you're new. I'll see you next time.